the whole bill was only 51.55. Joanna so Parker not, watches her utility statements closely. She tries to conserve electricity and doesn't set that thermostat too high. Joanna doesn't want to be surprised by a high gas or electric bill. You have to worry about it because it is. I mean, the way it is today, those bills can get out of control really quick over a few months. And if you don't worry about it, you're looking at a couple hundred dollars or more. This is the source of the cold weather here. First uh, Energy yeah. meteorologist Brian Colts monitors the weather. His data helps explain to customers why the frigid weather can drive up bills. We provide the uh, forecast to our rates department. Uh, they're the ones that uh, do the billing, uh, so they're aware of the cold weather that's coming. Andy says be prepared for temps next week to be colder than this week. Also, there, there may be some increases to the bills due to the colder temperatures. For the most part, it's just a matter of when it gets very cold, people use more of the commodity, whether it's electric, whether it's natural gas. First Energy spokesman Mark Durbin says if you're struggling to pay a higher than expected bill, call the company right away. A payment plan can be worked out. We have some very very uh, highly trained people that can try to work through whatever um, our customers need to make sure they're able to pay that bill. Low income families can also get help paying their utilities through energy assistance programs. Customers who qualify may be able to lower their bills through a program called PIP Plus. The uh, PIP program, the Percentage of Income Payment Plan program, is designed for low income households to establish a fixed payment plan based on their most recent 30 days of income. An appointment is needed to see if you qualify in Summit County. Call 1-866-504-7400. In Akron, Bob Jones, News Channel 5.